Hey everybody, it's been a while since I've uh, started doing some videos for iView 2, so I um, thought I'd start off with the new skins wizard that uh, that we added since uh, Ross has been doing some nice additions to the skins of late. Here we go. It's very easy. If we just go over to the IV repository and the system add-ons, I left it on there. Let me, sorry. There we go. System add-ons will be presented with this screen. Install from repository. Go down to IV2 TV Guide repo. And in program add-ons, you'll see here IV2 skins. Okay, so we install that. Add-on enabled. Okay, we come back out. You'll find this in program add-ons. And there it is, IV2 skins. And basically it will give you a preview of the of the skin. These are all the new ones that have just been updated today. I'm liking the blue haze personally. Purple's very nice. The mental axe from Chris Dacco was good as well. But they're all they're all lovely. But uh, there we go. Right, if I click on one of these, it's just going to download the skin and extract it. It's as simple as that. We're then going to need to go into the iView. There we go. It tells you here: skin successfully downloaded. Please close this. Go to the iView settings and appearance and choose the new skin. That's it. It can't be any simpler. So we go back into programs. Yep. And I view TV guides zero zero six on mine. Go into the add-on settings, appearance. You will now see the one that I just downloaded. Programs. I view two skins. Do that once more for everyone. Click on mental access time. Okay, done. Come out of the add-on into IVTV Guide settings, and we will now see mental axes in the list as well. That's it, guys. You choose the skin that you fancy, and you can load the guide up. As of this morning, 14th of March, 9 a.m., the guide data has been fixed due to some issues with daylight saving changes on Android devices. Um, but other than that, everything should now be working perfectly. Alright, keep an eye on the skins wizard. We'll be updating it with all new skins as and when we get chance. Um, and I'll be doing some more videos on some more functionality of iView 2 in preparation for iView 3 when it gets uh, released. Good luck everyone. Bye.